Welcome back guys to another Cinema 4D R19 tutorial. Today I'm going to show you a super fast and super great way to get super good looking renders. Um, I definitely didn't invent this, but I swear by it and that's pretty much the first render setting that I'll jump to if I want to see how something looks. It takes less than like 20 seconds to set up and you get incredible results. So I just set up a stupid little scene here through a cube, index to the middle of it, and I put a floor on top of a bigger cube. This is what we got. I just dropped a solid white texture with no reflectance on there. That's the only thing I changed. So this is what it looks like. Real bad, right? So the first thing that we're going to do, come to the render settings. We're going to change the anti-aliasing to best. And this area here, just right click, go ambient inclusion global illumination will X out that and then under the floor one just drop a physical sky in and let's render this out takes a little bit depending on uh, what computer running and stuff and boom look how much better that looks than it did before it's hard to see the back but I mean it looks a thousand times better and this pretty much works with any object you throw in here. I'll throw a sphere in here as well. My computer's been chugging lately. Drop that up there. It works really well with uh, flat textures without any uh, reflection and stuff on it. So, we'll just put the white texture on the sphere as well. And we'll give it a render. And it just looks super great. Um, but yeah, you can throw like almost anything into this render setting and it will look great. Um, I think it looks better with flatter colors with this kind of render setting. You don't want, you can have uh, reflections and stuff, but this is my go to. I just want to show you guys this and hopefully you like this and hopefully you guys will use it in the future. Alright, see you guys.